Alright, so um, I'm going to attempt to explain to you what the NVIDIA physics is and um, why you pretty much need it. So um, the way we do physics now, if you are going to simulate something like this, um, waterfall, which is real time, this is not pre-simulated or pre-rendered, it's real time, it's happening right now. Um, if you were to do it real time without the physics, it would basically um, take a very long time. So I can turn the, physic the NVIDIA physics off and you can see it'll start rendering it now and it's getting about four frames a second that's just not that much fun to look at and it wouldn't be that much fun to see in a game either and this is a pretty good computer to running it so as you can see very slow now if I turn the physics back on you can see it's a lot smoother because um, their physics engine that they use is uh, way better and it uh, distributes all of the rendering a lot better so as you can see much more fluid now I can also um, change the fluid to show you what we're dealing with it's pretty much you know thousands and thousands of little particles and it has to render all them interacting with each other and everything I can drop and it's real time so I can drop um, for example I can drop a bunch of balls and you can see them interacting with the water splashing through it you know so this is pretty much why it's needed in current games and you'll probably be seeing some much cooler stuff happening in games now with the physics and all that you can also um, I got this this is an NVIDIA fluid demo for the physics, so you can get this from NVIDIA. Just go on their site and search. Um, it's called a search power pack on their site, and I'll also post a link um, so you can just uh, go straight to it on the video. And so let's change it. Um, we'll toggle the scene to show you another one. So this is all real time. This is all, it's not pre rendered. Um, I can pretty much grab it if I want, turn it you know and the fluid will act accordingly so yeah look forward to physics coming in your games it's already in um, Mirror's Edge of course it keeps crashing because they didn't do it properly but I'm sure they'll get a patch out for it so yeah that's the video if you have any questions post a comment uh, post a comment on what you think about you know the physics and uh, rate the video alright thanks